Alliance Group. She's joining me to put an exclamation mark on the season with our second annual Gratitude Day parking lot party. And with gratitude, we welcome Dot. Yay! Hello, Dot. How are Hi. you doing? Good. Good. I'm so excited to talk to you today. First of all, you've got it. So it's the Gratitude Day parking lot party. Tell me what. Just, we'll just start with the beginning. What is Gratitude Day? Yeah, so Gratitude Day is actually an international holiday, and it was inspired by a meeting of people at the United Nations back in 1965, and they encouraged all the participating countries to go back and, and encourage their citizens to express gratitude. And um, it's interesting because most countries don't celebrate a form of Thanksgiving, which you would think oh. is kind of an equivalent. And so Gratitude Day is really what caught on for countries around the world. And as an organization, we were looking for some inspiration to host an event for the community. And September just seemed like an opportune month, yeah. weather-wise. Yeah. And as you know, kids are back in school and life is kind of regathering. Uh, and so we found Gratitude Day and decided to claim it uh, <laughs> as a reason and a theme for the event that we're now in our second season of hosting. Yes, so yeah, last year was the inaugural year. Now this year it's the Gratitude Day parking lot party. Tell me a little bit about what is going to happen at this party. Yeah, so um, we had such success last year by having a tiny house at our party. Oh, fun. So we're going to do that again. There'll be a tiny house at the party for people to tour um, and perhaps purchase if they're looking for a smaller space to add to um, their lifestyle. We'll do tours, of course, of our office because we've moved. So oh, one exciting. thing that's really kind of exciting this year is we'll have uh, people from the community and past clients, future clients, uh, attending to see our new space up on Lockport. We'll have free food and beverages, and you'll get to just kind of network and meet and greet and um, have conversations with your agents and others about real estate. Wonderful. And so the tiny houses are going to be there. Did you say greenhouses? Did I read something about greenhouses? Yeah, so last year we too? had a greenhouse. We're still working on getting the greenhouse okay. back because that too was a, a welcomed surprise for mm -hmm. participants. And then, of course, the food yes. is a big draw. Oh, yeah. People are going to come in from far and wide for the food. And to see your new offices, how yeah, cool! Yeah. So, why do you feel like it was important to invite this for you know your clients and the community to bring them together? Why was that an important thing for uh, Better Homes and Gardens Alliance Real Estate Group? Yeah. So, you know, we have so many agents out there that are impacting people's lives on a daily basis, and I think Paul Everson from our office, who is an agent, kind of put it best, um, saying that it really is a way for us to demonstrate our um, commitment to the community mm -hmm. um, and welcome people into our space. You know, quite often we're touring their spaces yeah, or future yeah, yeah. spaces and so we're bringing them back to our house which is really refreshing. Oh that is really neat. That's a great way to look at it. Um, not to get a sidetracked but you did bring in a cookbook. You have been giving away cookbooks and you have an exciting announcement to make today. Yeah so um, as people are watching our show every Thursday they're encouraged to scan that QR code for a chance to enter to win a monthly cookbook giveaway and we've got our first giveaway and I would exciting. love for you to help pick oh, the my gosh, recipient. I'm honored. So I'm honored. I just need a number between okay. one and 28. 1 and 28. I'm going to go with 19. So 19, I would like to say congratulations to Sharon Matter, who Sharon. won the cookbook. Right. So Sharon. we will get in touch with Sharon <laughs> to make sure that she can come and collect her cookbook. And hopefully it coincides with our event so she can tour the tiny house and office too. Absolutely. She can come show you the cookbook. Maybe have you sign it. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Autographed by Dot herself. Okay, Dot, do you want to run us through the details of the day? Anything that people need to know prior to attending? on September 19th. Yeah, so we would love for you to show up. Um, we would love for you to RSVP, but mm -hmm. RSVPs aren't necessary. Okay. You can find event details on our website as well as social media. Um, the big thing is it is Thursday. So next Thursday okay. from yeah. 4 to 7 p.m. at our address, which is on Lockport. We're just north of Bismarck Funeral Home. Okay. All right. Keep those details in mind next Thursday. Thanks so much, Dot. Thanks. Mm -hmm. All right. When we come back,